math and students, we are B. Will Abachi from Bell Yogurt. I'm Chelsea. I'm Raina. I'm Anthony. I'm Jemiah. And I'm Vanessa. Our mission as a team is to transform the yogurt from a, from a luxury food to a necessity food and to increase her profits and to improve the health and well-being of the Bauchi community. Um, by doing that, we have to first understand the problem. Uh, number one, the yogurt in Nigeria currently is a luxury food and not a necessity. And by making it a necessity, more people will have to buy it. Um, her income right now is just enough to support her family, so therefore she does not have any capital to expand the business and to make it more known in the area. And number, th and number three, the number of illnesses and vitamin deficiencies in the community is overwhelmingly high, which will make her uh, now more necessity yogurt to the people. All right, these are the main steps to solving this problem. Uh, she clearly stated that the small saw so way more than the large. So we figured let large dead in the water. So we we're going to introduce just a small flavor and make the new packaging in cups like so, so we can fit the fruit toppings in for the nutrients. Step two, we have to obtain, obtain the cheapest fruit, which in this case is oranges, so we can raise the price gradually along with the operating expenses. Our third step, we have to test on this idea for a month, make sure the customers are on board, rise the price gradually so as not scare customers away, and make sure the profits and sales rise gradually. And finally, step four, if the idea does work, we will introduce then mangoes, which is the second cheapest fruit in the area, to get him more of his experience in the idea form. Here we have a diagram that displays the, type, the top 10 causes of death in Nigeria. And among these 10, we've come up with four that we can s try to solve and try to prevent in the area through yogurt, um, uh, which are lower respiratory infections, digestive problems, protein, energy, malnutrition, and meningitis. Uh, we felt as though the fruits that could attack this problem were oranges, lemons, oats, citrus, and the yogurt itself. Okay, the business trends. Currently the small sells for 20 nairas and the large for 100. So again, we cut the 100 and focused on the small. Our one year plan at the end would be to have the small selling for at least 35 to 40 nairas after adding the fruit and the other added things. Um, she's currently selling 100 to 200 a day, but with all the increases in the fruit and the health and the knowledge that everybody will get from it, we're hoping to have 300 to 400 sold every day. Um, she currently has limited advertising and few posters, so we decided that she would maybe rename her business to further like explain what she does. So we renamed it with the Be Well Bouchy Yogurt, so that way it stands right there on the label. That's what it is. Um, so as we said before, it is currently a luxury item, so it's not uh, something that is uh, bought a lot. So by adding the fruits, we are going to make it a necessity for the nutrients and the health of the community, and therefore it'll be targeted towards everybody. And she has no competition in the area as of right now, so it is easy for her to um, go around with all the product. In the end, we all know it's about the green, it's about the money. How much money is she gonna make? Profit, <laughs> revenue. So, I took liberty of this is our first quarter projections for our business using this new plan. I also um, demonstrated the effect of balancing the operating costs to fit in the fruit as an operating cost expense. So, as you can see here, it rises because of the new idea. In the first month, it's going to be a little test run. She's probably going to break even and have a little bit of profit, right? But over time, as Omar said, it's about where the plane takes off and where it lands, not the ride there. So, we figure we will raise the price five dollars a month, not scare away customers, introduce the idea gradually. Okay, end goals, we wanted to make sure that her company were to spread across Nigeria. Maybe other people would start putting fruit in their yogurt. That would be the main goal. Um, in the end, after she achieves more money, she would be able to use radio advertisements, which would really put it over to the plus to a surplus because that's what most people use. Um, so, okay. So basically, this is the advertisement we come up with. Uh, so, B, well. Balji, yogurt. Check it. <laughs> okay, Umar, you go first, buddy. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> this is called.
try the research. I don't know, maybe you guys have slept with professors in your room, but this is quite a very well and excellent research. I love it. Because um, you are so realistic in about changing the whole business concept. What I'm amazed about is that it's not all about making her yogurt to look uh, more healthier, right? It's like you added some techniques and some logic in that particular market. By making sure you eliminate the big bottles so that the small one can keep going, and at the end of the day, you can now make an increase, that's quite a long. It's a long plan, but actually a very good one. Yeah. Um, just one thing I can say. One thing, one thing. Be well about your other. Yeah. Maybe if you can find a way to uh, maybe replace that or change that so that uh, she can actually, or it can actually <laughs> direct it to her side. So, because that one looks big. Because the state government can be able to uh, open a yoga company and uh, it can go like that. But I am so, so amazed with your presentation and all the ideas. It is excellent. Thank you. I really love it. Thank you. Thank you. I think being well yogurt would suffice, um, and I'm hoping that you spoke to her about it. In addition to that, I agree also that your research is very thorough, um, and that I really appreciate it, especially with you including the charts, um, illnesses, and the community aspect of it, I feel was extremely important. You mentioned it a couple of times that it's not just about, it didn't seem like it was just about finances, but it was about the community at large. Um, and informing them on the importance of yogurt. So I, I think I think you did a did very well with the presentation and with coming up with solutions. Thank you. And then also the presentation, I think you flowed very well. The way that it was laid out um, as far as going from issue to plan and concept. Thank you. So I was very, very, very happy with everything you did. Um, starting with the health focus, and it can scare a lot of business owners. It can scare them and they'll run away. But every slide you had backed up your proposal, making it not just more plausible each slide you showed, but then convinced me. Sarah's like, oh, she's never gonna go for this. Yeah. And then, no, it's was too. But slowly but surely, you convinced us not only through like your presentation, but your showmanship. You know, the joke at the end, everything was the complete package. I really, really appreciate it. You immediately stepped up your game, so great job. Join the Global Young Innovators Initiative. Transform the world www.icantransformtheworld.org